Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to Fort Lauderdale, Florida during spring break. It's March 21st, 2022. It's 3.45 p.m. and it's 79 Fahrenheit, 26 Celsius. There's a pool party happening here. We're gonna get to see some of it now. And uh, I'm gonna walk by uh, the beach area in Fort Lauderdale, show you some of the craziness here of spring break. Are they gonna ID us? <laughs> okay, what's up? What happens? Ring breakers gone wild. I got enough. Yeah, it's crazy because last time I was here on a Saturday, there was zero, you know, entry fee. Now oh. it's, they get you. Now they get it, but it was worth the experience. It was worth it, it was worth it. This, this is a barefoot vlogger. He has his own YouTube channel, covers mostly South Florida. Go check him out. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Another beautiful day in sunny Florida. Thanks for joining us. About 80 degrees when we uh, park the car and nice breeze coming from the east. So awesome vlogging and live streaming conditions. Oh yeah. I can go back into that club again if I want to. Good for all day probably. Take a dip in the pool maybe? Shortcut here oh, or sure. that way? Let's go this way. Okay. It's Las Olas Boulevard, right? That's Las Olas, yes. Home of the famous Elbow Room, which we'll be passing here shortly. I was here just uh, last week and uh, now it's a different crowd of spring breakers here because each university, each college has a separate spring break. They're not going to be all at the same time. How's beach pizza? It's pretty good. Yeah? It this place is good? Very good. 
Ah. New York style? Uh, the flop is. The flop is pretty good. The flop's good. I give it 7 out of 10. Okay. 7 out of 10 is not bad. That's not bad. Uh, Eight. Yeah. Came here from Boca, originally from New York. Yeah. I'm from New York now. I'm in, I'm in Miami. Now you're in Miami? Yeah. Uh, what schools are out there? You guys know? What schools are out? Yeah. Um, a lot of like the bigger state schools, universities. Uh, we're out there on spring break last week. Uh, I guess I'm like, from the Midwest, so I guess like Iowa, uh, Minnesota, uh, Minnesota, 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 right? Yeah, you <laughs> you oh, she looks like she's gonna rain tonight. Right? <laughs> yeah. Florida, one of my favorite. Like no, you don't. Know. <laughs> so much better. Well, enjoy your meal. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy your meal. There you go. Yeah. Enjoy the other half. Yeah. Thanks for chatting, guys. Yeah. All right. Have fun. Thank you. Other than Action Kid, straight up here to Fort Lauderdale from down south Miami. That's right. Made the trip to check out Spring Break on Again. this Monday afternoon. Please check out his channel if you haven't already. Many of you have come over from his channel, so we are very appreciative of that. But if you haven't, Barefoot Army, please join Action Kid. Joyce Mike here in South Florida. Here we are at the world famous Eldo Room. Oh, we got a sax player playing. Uh, looks busier now than last time. What's up? Look at that, look at the beach, it's so crowded. Yeah, it's hard to believe, Ken, but that elbow room. Wow. One of the few remaining unchanged mainstays here on the Fort Lauderdale Strip. Wow. It's been here for almost 80 years. That's unbelievable. Came into fame from the movie Where the Boys Are. Everything must go. You think this is true or not? Or they say this every time. <laughs> they mark it up 100% before they mark it down 50%. <laughs> $9.99 bikinis. They're asking for it here. You know, Ken, back in the day, a lot of these shops, these little retail stores, yep. were seasonal. So they would literally close down in the wintertime, be all boarded up. And uh, they would just open for this short period of time and make all their money, enough money, to get them through the entire year. I can believe it, yep. There were a lot more people in this bar the last time I was here. So, uh, Ken, this is the bar that has the pool where you came from. This is the other oh, side. Oh, it is. Of it. Yep, the uh huh. Oh yeah, I have it. The wristband.
How are the prices here? Let's take a look. They can make the menu a little bit less uh, bubbly. Uh. That's where they get you, man. $30 Jimmy Janga. It ain't Taco Bell. Nope. Surprised they can get a New York strip steak here. This activity, even on a Monday afternoon, about 4 p.m. Eastern Time, and uh, a lot of people out enjoying it. Good, it's good. And she said no. And she's calling this over. You're at the wrong table. <laughs> selling yacht charters there. Here's the world famous drunken taco. Have you ever tried this place? Yeah, it's good. What are they known for? Really good food. The tacos. tacos and drinks? Yeah. That taco bowl looks good. Tostadas. And they're really well known for their all day happy hour. Look at that. You don't huh? have to wait till 4 or 5 o'clock. It's all day. That's why they call it Drunken Taco. <laughs> We got over here Cafe Del Mar, Cafe of the Sea. What's up? Hey, what's, going what's going on? What school are we from? UCF. 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 Central Florida. Central Florida. Central Florida. Well, I thought you guys had the Knights, right? Yeah. Yeah. Why don't you go somewhere else, man? There you go. I thought your guys swing back is over though. Bitch, I'm geeking on these persons. The people I saw here last week were cutting out the square. What's up? Guys, you never do that when you live in a Guys, is this like YouTube or something? Yeah, YouTube. Guys, guys. If you ain't twiz, you ain't doing it. Bitch, I'm geeking on these persons. I don't pilot. How much is that? How much is that? Not for real, though, guys. Get your shit in order. Like, don't go out unless your shit's straight. Straight up, I got you. Like, you, you guys your shit done, you can go out. You are you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Don't be a poor like loser. You know what I mean? Like you don't have your boring. shit together. You don't have your money made. You don't have your grades right. You're a poor son. Don't do it. You know what I mean? You don't want to be like this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get your money up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're straight. Yeah. It's a steady yeah. cam. Yeah. Yeah. I was, I was inspiration. Yeah. Oh, I'm on. I'm on. It's true. That's right. It's true. Everything you said is true. You guys are paying attention to class, don't you? I held it four point nine. I'll bet. I'll bet. Four point nine. Three nine. Three nine. Okay. All right. <laughs> I know, I know. So, what do you, so he's business, what are you guys? I'm, I'm going to business. So it is, a, is there a doctor in the house? This guy turns Oh, wow. There you go. Plastic surgery. Plastic surgery? I need you right now. It's okay, you don't have to graduate. Let's go. All right, and what about you? 
business also. Okay. He got a, he got a full ride scholarship to play football in college. So really? Yeah. yeah. He's the man right here. Full ride. Full ride. What, what school? It's in Texas. I know you brought your ball. Right now. That's okay. Wow. If it's a full ride, we don't care what it's called. Exactly. North American. AFU. <laughs> any university. Yeah. Oh, right. no, they're going to pay for shit. it. That's He's it. going to go. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Listen. Have fun. Be yeah, safe. Yeah, and be yeah, careful. Of course, my man. I will see you on YouTube. Hey there. Okay. Right, man. Take Peace care. Peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Stay safe. <laughs> 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 All right, we got one school down. Yeah. yeah. What happened, bro? What happened? <laughs> This music should calm things down a little bit. Right? Yeah, just a little. What's up? And the famous beach place. It's probably, right. it's too hey. What is it like? Three floors in this mall? Yeah, at least. Yeah. And uh, the whole idea behind beach place years ago, when they first put it in, was to attempt to attract a sort of a different crowd. They didn't want just spring breakers coming here because that's what it used to be back in the in, in the day. It was this was a spring breaker, you know? Haven, uh -huh. and they wanted to change that up and make it a little more family oriented. So they put those walls in along the. Those didn't, oh, when I, I first see. moved here, those walls were not here. They put those in, and um, and then they built this beach place. Okay. But you know what? The Spring Breakers are still coming here too. Well, they they stopped coming for a while, and then they started coming back. So now, actually, it worked out great because they got the best of all worlds. Uh huh. They have all sorts of. Uh, you know, mixes of people coming here. Families, young people, couples, singles, they got it all. You got the Hooters up there with a nice... That's got to be the Hooters with the best view in the country. I can see why. You got top floor view there. Like one, two, at least three floors. They have an escalator here to take up too if you don't feel like taking the stairs. Escape room is behind who is. This this kind of concept really exploded in the past like five, ten years. Have you ever tried that before? I've been in a few, yeah. yeah. Probably about like four or five. It's a lot of work, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, you know. It is. A lot of cooperation. People have to get their heads together and be Work as a team, I guess. You get to find out really quickly if uh, someone's your enemy or not. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. How strong your friendship really is. Yeah. When it's under pressure. So this is nice. It's kind of a courtyard sort of feel to it. Open air. Almost like a like a little piazza. Yeah. It feels European. Yeah. Seems a lot le less busy than uh, last week when I came. Yeah, I think this probably gets busier once people start coming off the beach. During the day when it's light and it's nice, everybody wants to get their beach time in, you know? Go mm -hmm. in the ocean. That's right. The party's on the beach. Yeah, let's cross the street and uh, walk on the side of the beach there. Good idea. Got these fresh coconuts here that they'll open up for you. Look at them all in the cart there. I wonder how much they charge for one. Uh, coconut seven dollars. Twenty bucks for a half a gallon of coconut water. 
35 for a gallon. I mean, it's good stuff. Wow. Pretty soon our gas will cost that much. You'll be powering your gas with coconut water instead. <laughs> Oh, pedal power. Good observation. It's a there. good way to get up and down the beach pretty reasonably and pretty quickly. Someone lost their pit bull mix. If anyone knows. Yep. Well, we gotta push the button. This was a stop for us, right? If they see us. Huh? Thank you. And here's beach place from across the street. Now you really get to see the hooters and the the bar on the second floor there. Yeah, so that's a great place to have a couple of drinks or sit down and have lunch because look at that view. You can't beat it. Does it get this crowded like in the summertime here or is it just spring break? No, it's a combination of two things really. It's a combination of spring break and also a lot of people are down from up north for um, you know the snowbirds that live down here. There I are see. people we call them, as you know, snowbirds. So they live down here only half the year. Uh, they come down here to get out of the cold, but then they go back up north to get out of the heat and humidity in the hey, summertime man. here. So hey. they really have the best of both worlds. Hey, so Thank you, brother. You know the deal. Bless both of them the rest of their life. I demand that Lord in Jesus' name, scratch his blood. Amen. Amen. Give them Amen. a wonderful life until they go to heaven. Thank, Thank you. you. We'll God bless Take both care. Of we'll see you up there. Yes, you will. Hopefully not for a while, though. We'll be up there billions of years. They only live in 80 because they're sick. There you go. We're going to live for billions of years. I didn't know this. I had to change. So we pray for them. Some of them are going to come All right, my friend. Thank you. You won't find a Taco Bell anywhere in the world with a better view than that one has. <laughs> That's that right. is a Taco Bell. Looks like a taco house. You have the Taco Bell right below the Crystal Ballroom. Only in Fort Lauderdale, ladies and gentlemen. Now you can see the crowd. That's right. Starting to thicken up here as we progress towards Las Olas. Hi. Hello. The most dense part of the Lauderdale Beach is by Las Olas. Where do all these people stay anyway? They can't all they can't all fit in the courtyard Marriott over there, right? I, that's what I want to know. That, that would be the place to stay. That must book up faster than anything else, just because of its proximity to Las Olas and the beach. Yeah. I was able to go into the the pool area over there. Oh yeah, how yeah. was it? It's nice. It's a small pool, but you know, people are having a good time there.
Amazing that even on such a windy day, you could still get that whiff of smell in the air. That's right. You know what that is. And it's, uh, it's everywhere. I see a lot of people with sunburned backs and skin. Yeah, you can learn the hard way the first day out here. If you're not used to the heat, even in you know early spring, you got to cover up if you're light complected because you will burn. Schools are out now? Now? Okay. Thought I'd ask. Guess they're not in school. We have the mounted police here. I see. Patrolling. So here we are. There's the elbow room. We're back to Las Olas and A1A. Alright, well, that was an overview of the busiest parts of Fort Lauderdale for spring break. It was a very eventful day here on this uh, March 21st, 2022. Hope you enjoyed it. Smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you later. Bye! Also, be sure to subscribe to this guy here, Barefoot Vlogger. Hey guys, this is it. Welcome to Spring Break 2022. Thanks for joining us. We're having fun, I hope you are.